Hey guys, it's Paul here, and today we're looking at this Drio ceramic space heater. And uh, we've had this for over a year now, and we use it in different small spaces, such as our bedroom in the winter or uh, in the bathroom, to heat up the bathroom when we're taking a shower or for my daughter when she's taking a bath. And it's a bit taller than your normal one. It's, uh, let's see here, let's measure it here. It stands at about 24 inches in height, and uh, from the base, it's about 7, 8 inches on the base, as measured here. It comes with a remote, uh, but we often don't really use that. Alright, so I'm going to turn it on for you just so you can hear what it sounds like. This is a decibel sound meter just to give you an idea of how loud it is. So the room without it on is about 35 decibels. So let's see how. So with it on, it's about 48 decibels. And currently it's on eco mode and I'll give you a heat rating on here just so you can see how much heat it's producing. It's uh, at 175, almost 200. You see, 185, one, yeah, 175, 180 in the middle there. So I'm gonna turn it on high mode and see how hot it gets. So on high mode here, we can get up to two over 200 Fahrenheit. Versus earlier, it was at 180. So I see 220. Plus it probably takes some time to heat up, but yeah. So there's eco mode, low, and high. Three different heat modes. And you can also turn it to the oscillating mode here. So it goes back and forth and spins. And you can also have set a timer for it to auto shut off. There's also a tip setting. So if it tips over, it turns off. And then when you turn it off, there's a cooldown countdown on top from 15 to 0. And you can set your temperature range of what you would like to heat it at, and it will automatically uh, shut down the heat once it reaches that temperature. So overall, you know, it's a, a decent space heater for what you need to use it for. And I hope that gives you a good idea of what to buy. So thanks for watching.